goals. Forrest right on the brink of safety. One point will definitely do it. And here comes Mull of Kintyre with the banner away to our left, across the two tiers, between the two tiers of the Trent End, which says, when they try to keep us down, we show them who we are. Forest fans making their views very clear and making their noise on the final home game of the season. Casado, Thiago Silva forward towards Cole Palmer. Palmer tries to thread one in behind the fullback and he's got Mudrick away and Mudrick scores. Mudrick inside left channel. It's a lovely ball from Cole Palmer. And Mikhailo Mudrick gives Chelsea the lead, cutting inside away from Gonzalo Montiel. Bolly couldn't close down the gap in time either and Mudrick rolls it into the net from an angle. Matt Sells no chance. Low finish from Mudrick from the inside left channel. And Chelsea have an early lead. It's only taken them seven minutes. It's the first time they've threatened. And Mikhailo Mudrick's seventh goal. Here's one Forest free kick. Which is uh, going to be taken by Gibbs White, just left of centre. Chips it into the penalty area. Bolly, free header. Yes! Goal! Forest are on terms. It's 1 1. Gibbs White with the delivery. Danilo won the free kick with his run. Gibbs White with the delivery. And Willie Bolly arriving at the back post. Completely unmarked. About six yards out. Heads it in. And Forrest are level after 15 minutes. It's been 15 good minutes from Forrest. Bar one moment where they were undone by Cole Palmer and slipped behind. And now Bolly has them on terms. Just on the quarter of an hour mark. Just seeing a replay, I think Badia Shiel is going to be playing Willy Bolly on the side. And so the goal, I would imagine, will stand. But he certainly was going on target. Another corner. Danilo is the man who's going to take from the forest right, left footed, in swinging. Oh, uh, it's Petrovic palms it away straight onto the head of Wood, who heads it over the crossbar. Difficult chance for Chris Wood, half chance really, arriving late. Uh, well outside the far post and with not much of an angle to aim at as it was flicked on by the glove of Petrovic and it's behind and it remains 1-1 yeah again now Chelsea move it and Murillo takes it off Kukurea and Murillo looking up oh, oh. plays a lovely pass into hudson Adoy's feet hudson Adoy towards the edge of the penalty area shoots and Thiago Silva blocks it comes down for Wood who running onto it tried to volley and did volley but didn't get much on it, and it Silver. was play it calmly out to Casado. Well won by Ola Aina. Superb tackle into Wood's feet. Wood lays it off for near Kate. Now Aina again, 20 yards out, rolls it across to Gibbs White. Gibbs White to the right edge of the penalty area for Montiel. Turns it back in field to Yates. Yates edge of the D. Yeah! Shoots oh! low, just wide. I thought it was in. Just wide of the target from Ryan Yates, but really good football from Forrest. They worked Chelsea one way and then the other, and every time Chelsea tried to get it clear, they were unable to do so. Forrest won it back again, and in the end, they fashioned the shooting opportunity for Ryan Yates. Wow, oh. that was close. It's hit the base of the post. Now back heels to Ola Aina, who's 10 yards into the Chelsea half and still going forward and running across field as well, and finding a good ball to Montiel. Montiel with a little bit of room to tee up the cross. Danilo on the edge of the, on the penalty spot, heads it towards goal. Cleared out to Hudson Adoy, left hand side, inside left channel, twisting one way and then the other. Back post. It's oh! oh, somehow Forrest oh, has scored. It. It's over the bar from Chris Wood from a yard out. Morgan Gibbs White met it at the back post. Somehow it stayed out from his header. I think it hit the post from Gibbs White from about half a yard out. It fell to Wood a yard out on the rebound and he's put it over the bar I, I it remains 1-1 I can't believe he's missed it brilliant a little chip on the far post giving everybody the escape and there was Gibbs White flying in the air he's headed the ball back across the goal and just a few yards in from the right hand touchline Palmer and Gallagher the two standing over it it is going to be Cole Palmer, left-footed, six-yard box, it oh. hits the post. Little glancing header from Thiago Silva. Chelsea's turn 
to hit the post. Forrest have done it twice in the second half, and now Chelsea have as well. Here's Mudrick for Palmer again. Showed too much of that to Yates, but his clearance goes straight to Gallagher. Yates intercepts again. Bolly, left wing. Great ball. Hudson Adoy leaps after it, gets to it. Chelsea stretched. Hudson Adoy towards the edge Go of on. the penalty area. Cuts inside onto his oh. right foot. Oh. Cozy hits the bar. Oh, to call Off it. the deflection. Hits the crossbar. The third time that Forrest have hit Woodwork in the second half. And it gives them a corner. Thrilling wow. break. Brilliant counter attacking break from Forrest there. Brilliant ball out from Bolly, and then it says sprint on the halfway line all the way to the Doy, who just looks as a nice little overlap from Gibbs White taking the defender away, and he just opens his gate up, right footed, trying to curl it into the far corner. The referee was unsure. Matt Sells, all in royal blue, clears from uh, right to left. It's nodded infield by Ain. A lovely play, Gibbs White and Elanga. And that gets Gibbs White away, and he's given it to Hudson Adoy. Hudson Adoy going to cut in onto his right. Yes! Play. He scores! He scores against his old club! Callum Hudson Adoy's done it again from the edge of the penalty area. Beautiful break from Forrest. One end of the field to the other. Started by Sells. Ended by Callum Hudson Adoy against Chelsea onto his right foot, curled it low into the bottom corner past Georgia Petrovic. And with 15 minutes to go on a day when Forrest need a point to guarantee, absolutely guarantee, their Premier League safety, Callum Hudson Adoy makes it Forrest 2, Chelsea 1. Wow, what a feeling it must be for Adoy, scoring against his former club, showing them exactly what they're missing. He might not have shown it as many times at Chelsea, but what we've seen over the coming weeks, the last few weeks, what does a doy like doing? He likes to come in and cut inside on his right foot. Chelsea know all that, yet they give him the time, they give him the space, and what a finish, right footed. Rhys James gets it back from Gusto and turns it back along the line for Casado. 15 yards into the forest half, drifting into the middle of forest territory now and turns it away towards the left-hand side for Raheem Sterling into the penalty area. Right foot curls it into the bottom corner. He's done. A Callum Hudson Adoy, he's done exactly the same. Runs in from the left hand side, cuts into the penalty area onto his right foot and curls it in low. And Chelsea were only behind for four minutes. Raheem Sterling with the equaliser. And it is Forrest 2, Chelsea 2. Uh, again, you know, it just shows you with pace, if you cut inside, you, you create space. And there he was, you see Sterling just cutting, he opens his body up, curls it right in that far corner, giving the goalkeeper no chance whatsoever. Again, this is Kukurea down the left-hand side, Sangare and Dominguez wait to come on for Forrest, nine minutes of normal time remaining. Casado with a good ball, right-hand side for Rhys James, Forrest a bit exposed again, James with a cross, header at the back post is in from Nicholas Jackson. Chelsea now lead, 3-2. Jackson with the header, there was far, far too much space down that right-hand side for Rhys James, and his cross picked out Jackson at the back post, and in the space of a couple of minutes, the party around the city ground has fallen silent, and it's the away fans who are now doing the singing and the cheering because their side, Chelsea, lead 3-2, and Forrester back to only being three points and goal difference outside the relegation zone. Well, again, it's a, it was just a few minutes before that where Toffolo's got sucked in, and there's been a huge gap down this right-hand side. Just got caught out cold.